My name is Isaiah. One reason for mountain bike trails at Touch is because there aren't any designated mountain bike trails in this area. We have an outdoor recreation undergraduate program as well as a master's program and so it can be used as a tool for programming, for classes, and just uh, as something to draw tourists to the area. And one of the biggest components from the start has been educating community members. And so this project has been 100% volunteer led. As we're going now, we hope to have an initial loop of trail that people can ride by the end of this year. If that continues well, we hope to receive more funding and this project could keep going for a long time. The volunteers that are coming out today, they're community members, they're students, they're people that are passionate about mountain biking or maybe they're just people that are passionate about this place. And then we'll go out into the woods and actually construct trail, which involves excavating dirt, uh, broadcasting that dirt, you know, moving it around the forest so that we're not making a home for invasive plants and then finally finishing that trail so that it's ready to ride. So this is the trailhead. Uh, it's the start of what we hope to be 30, 30 plus miles of trail, uh, multi-use, so mountain bikers, hikers, runners. People will come from hours away to ride on a purpose-built trail. So this is the start of the trail that we've cut in so far and it's going to look mostly like a patch of dirt and it's going to feel pretty natural so we, we try to imitate exactly what nature presents for us and that's the most sustainable way to build trails but it's also the most fun trail that you can move down. I inherited this project from another graduate student who started the thing off and so I hope to see this project grow to be able to pass it off uh, to somebody else either another student graduate student and to see this thing uh, continue into the future. It's just going to be a huge tool for the university. If it weren't for SIU and the programs that they run, this wouldn't be here.